Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Kingdom Come Deliverance. I really, really hope I'm not wrong about what I did. My boy, my boy, what have you done? This is a disaster. I... I gain reputation though, and I, that, I love it. I love the disasters. Now, can I knock you out? Because I probably will need to. Because this thing, this is bad. So last episode we used, we did a little bit of transcri transcribing and it didn't work well. Why are you guys talking? Don't talk. What is this? A tavern? A dogfight? Ah, last episode was a nightmare. And now I can't leave here because of nightmares. Just nightmares. Just nightmares all day, forever, and I hate it. Also that cutscene lasted forever and then it didn't and I hate it. Um, but anyway, we transcribed the things and apparently the disasters are good. Hey, can I talk to you, sir? Praise be to Christ. Yes. Uh, can I ask you? I'd like to. Oh, yeah, I can ask you all the things. Uh... Who would you like to be the new abbot? John, definitely. Oh, there it is. It's always John, isn't it? Hmm. So. They are not looking. But I have not saved in between episodes. I could take you out, but I really want to go in here. He's going to see me, isn't he? Salve, Domine. I don't know where this leads to. I don't want this to... Um, I can't save because I don't have save, save your snaps. Let's find out. Let's do it properly. This one... T oh, crap! I can't do it properly. I was going to say this one time. But I can't do it properly. Maybe I can. Um, save your snaps. I need one. Come on. Where the heck is it? There it is. One nettle, two belladonna. Uh, prepare wine and two belladonna. No, shut up. Uh, boil the nettle for two turns. Grind the belladonna. Yeah, let's just get Nettle and, and Belladonna. I uh, do have Belladonna, though. Oh, crap! Belladonna is rare. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, I have another plan for this. Let's go upstairs, though, because it's all bad. So, the plan is this. It's very simple, very straightforward. Save and exit. Because in reality... I would be able to know what's going on in here. We could just stay here and be like, mm -hmm, as I pick the lock, uh, somehow. Let's find out if I'm seen. I am seen. Let's find out what happens when I'm seen. It was. <laughs> just like that. Uh, don't know what it does. Oh wait, fleas and things. This guy was studying fleas. And warts. I wonder if that matters. Hey, you don't mind me going in here, because that's why that's why it's janky. Because if I do this, novices have no business here. Yeah. So, I'm looking for forbidden texts. There's a lot of things I have no business with. And I think I've been here back here already. And I think also that this is the abbot's quarters. Or maybe not. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Who the heck's this guy? It's the prior. Knock him out. I shouldn't be here, so... Nobody's gonna... Yeah, that's good. Okay. What have we here? What have we here? Yeah. That's it. The book with information about the novices. Good, good, good. Siskin, the youngest son of the illustrious Sir Flashka. Uh, Baron, his faith is tepid. Uh, Jovok, in spite of his sinful past, he could prove to be a right and true model for the other novices. Antonius, the son of a wealthy merchant of Vlashim. He studied theology at the University in Prague. Lucas, quiet, studious, and humble, a true candidate for the Order of St. Benedict. Gregor, a largely unsuitable candidate for the monastic life. He's the son of a nobleman of lower rank. 
He seems to pose more problems than even Siskin, accustomed to wealth, intoxication, and phila philandering, yet forced to don the monk's habit at the direct command of Lord Dauba, whose daughter he made with child. Yeah, we heard that story. But is it Greg or is it Siskin? Interesting. I still don't know which one of them is pious. That's true. Judge and notes, though. Can loot you. Yeah, I'll take that. Can I not? Okay. Shh. Nobody's gonna mind any of this. They, they really don't keep anything tidy in here. It's all messy as crap. Look at this. Just food all over the place. Holy crap. I've been neglecting my duties. I'll show you. One single lockpick is all I need. There you go. Oh, I'm not neglecting my duties anymore. I might also be outside. <laughs> oh, where is it? There it is. Didn't break it. Holy crap. Is this stealing? It's not stealing. Okay, so... A cleaver? What is that? It's a hunting sword. Take that. Stalwart. That's uh, 46. Yeah, I need that, that one right there. And that's that. Okay. But I think we're outside. Or maybe we're not. I also don't know that I'm... I might be neglecting my, my duties here. Oh yeah, we're definitely outside. Are still down? Good. Keep it. So I remember being here when I was stealing from them. So I'm thinking... Let's go back to here, because we are going to need to be careful about studying this. It must be said that his manner gives rise to doubt about his claims. I shall have to send an inquiry to Father Stefan. That's the one, Antonio's. To determine if he is indeed known in the part of the land, it's Antonio's. And I sort of suspected him. And it makes sense that it would be him. Hi. Hi. You guys don't mind any of what I just did, do you? Also, I'm not... You'll notice that I'm not... Um, oh, Jotter knows this is more important. Remember, descend from the gate of faith between the shadow of the cathedral and the wooden stockade. Pass contritely through the dry river bed beneath the great bridge. Like Moses, fearlessly steal the waters. Ascend to dry land among the bulrushes. Find your faith and search in the burning bush. Uh, that's outside, I'm going to say. The gate of faith. Hey, are you, uh, Jew, are you mad? Talk to me, brother. You're not mad, are you? You're not mad, okay. So I still haven't found all the pages, which is a big problem. A huge problem. Because there's only one, and I have no idea where it is. And it's the most annoying kind of quests. That's, that's, yeah, it's just a huge problem. And nobody minded any of that, which is great. Because they should. They should have, but we didn't. They didn't, and I sort of knew they wouldn't. That's why I was so, well, I was taking so many risks. Uh, let's look now at our everyday labors, make sure I am doing the thing. So at 4 p.m. we need afternoon worship, which is good because everybody unites there. And Antonius, I, I'm pretty sure it's Antonius, but I need to get him drunk and need to get him out of here. That's the quest, I think. Let's look at them. Um, I have to find... Well, no, that's not lost and found. It appears you left some important things in the hands of a corpse. The grave digger has disposed of the corpse and safely stored away the departed's worldly goods at the Ratai Presbytery, where you can pick them. Really? Okay. Um, 
What I need, though, is this. Brother Nevelis, who is standing for Abbot, would like to know what is going on in the monastery. So I did all of that, but that's not the main quest. This is the one. I have to find one of the per perpetrators of the Neuhof massacre, Pius, among the monastery's novices. But how will I know? Uh, I doubt he'll tell me himself, and I won't want to kill an innocent man. Well, <laughs> I'll just have to try and blend in here and look for any clues that might lead me to him. For now, I don't know which one of the novices he is, but I, once I find out, he should die. Or I could bring him to justice. I talked to Sir Radzig about my mission to track down Pius and kill him, but Sir Radzig would rather hand him over to justice instead. That's the one I. That's what I was uh, thinking of, and specifically, uh, specifically uh, having doubts about. Not really doubts, but it's just making sure I'm doing the right thing. Okay, there's nothing back here. Forbidden books, huh. written by the devil himself. Oh yeah. Forget about them. Ah, I forgot what books? I don't know. Um, yeah. So there's nothing here in the mon in the library. Uh, and I, as far as I can tell, there's nothing in there either. There's just a very mad abbot, I would think. Or p Prior, whatever. They have different names, and I think they might stand for the same thing, and I just don't know. Uh, so these are all steel, so I... Ooh. Oh, yeah, you're going to see me immediately if I do that. Uh, hey, can I talk to you? What troubles you? No. I mean, I can. It's just... It doesn't work quite like that. Are you interested in what's Again? Forbidden books you're asking that I kill you, aren't himself. you? Because I will kill you. I will kill you. I need to kill you. One of, one of these days. Righteous retribution. So you might remember. So people are eating. There's somebody coming for me. There's this place. These guys are not, are not going to tell me to bugger off. Found it. Can't believe I found it. Okay. Find the pages of the torn up book. Oh, don't go upstairs. Go to see the librarian. Yes, I'm going. Okay. Good, good, good. Also, that wasn't upstairs. That was the kitchen. Hi. Hello. Ah, uh, Gregor. Yes. I have all the pages of the torn up book. The art of love can go back to the library. Oh, brother, you can't even imagine how happy you've made me. I can, unfortunately. Since you're clearly a true lover of books, I'll give you a reward I've never given another novice. Oh, I... I'll lend you the key to the cabinet containing forbidden books, and you can look at the peculiar things we've accumulated there. That cabinet's strictly off-limits to novices, but you've earned my trust. I'm sure you'll recognize that those books contain nothing but dangerous gibberish. <laughs> oh. And there's a valuable lesson to be learned there. No, I doubt, I doubt that I there appreciate is. Your trust. For you, anyway. Uh, I have gained a new level in drinking, somehow. But is there anything I can do to help here? I, don't ask. I'm glad you asked. There's one thing. A silly thing, really. I haven't thought to mention it to anyone before. But not long ago, a brother brought me a crumpled piece of parchment. He says he found it rolled up in a hole in the wall. The thing is, it was a page from Ovid. Oh, I have that Ovid? book already. What is that? Is it the name of a book? It's the name of... Not what, it's but we... who? Yeah. Ovid was a Didn't... great Roman poet. Didn't we have that? We have a few volumes by him in the library, but one of them vanished one day. Now I believe I can guess what happened. Brother Eustace, may the earth rest lightly on him, was quite narrow-minded when it came to classical literature. If a book had any mention... Yeah, we heard if this. If he'd had his... We heard this. Can you tell me something about the book? The Art of Love... What? Why did you... Why is that? What? Come on. Less jank? What do you... I'd like... To... Yeah, I think it was just there because the it, the script doesn't trigger until we leave the dialogue. Engine limitations, I wonder. Can't do anything. Oh, are you telling me? That's not engine limitations, it's just a plain old oversight. Are you still telling me that? Seriously? 
Seriously. Anyway, we did it. Which is great. Um, okay, in the cloister. Now, I will just need to look around. So I think, I'm, I'm betting it's Antonius. Service. Oh, there's the abbot. Hello, you definitely didn't die. Hello. I'm a new brother, a novice, Gregor. I don't know my way around here yet. You're in charge of the whole monastery, aren't you? Welcome amongst us. Yes, yes. The Lord wanted me to take over the abbot's duties in his absence, but mainly I'm a servant of God, just like you and all the other brethren. Before God, there's no difference between us. How do you like it here? It's wonderful here. I'm glad to hear it. May your enthusiasm last. Oh boy, that was threatening. I'd like to ask you something about the monastery. Oh, there's a lot of things. Okay. Um... Mm -hmm. Will you tell me something about how the abbot is elected? Of course. Abbot Peter is old, and we're afraid he'll soon be with our Heavenly Father. Maybe he's not the abbot. Maybe when he's, he's gone, prior. someone else will have to lead the monastery. All the elder brothers will assemble to choose who that is. Anyone can become the abbot. Precisely. We have two candidates, Nevlas and John. As the spiritual shepherd of all of the brothers here, I'm not allowed to publicly express a preference for either. And as a novice, you shouldn't be involved in the election. I know that some brothers have already begun scheming, but don't even think about getting mixed up in it. With the blessing of the Holy Spirit, all will end up as it should be. Okay, especially if you declare it that it was as it should be after it ends up. Uh, so we need to go to the church now. Not church, the main hall thing. If I can find my way around, I think it's over there. Mm -hmm, that's for the sleeping quarters, and this is where we should be. Here we are. Oh, it, uh, it was in the compass as well. I didn't didn't notice that. Uh, hi. Oh, John. Hi. This is not a good time for questions, brother. No, it is not. But I can try to kill you, though. Hmm. Oh. Brother? What? Oh, don't you dare. You were somewhere you shouldn't have been. Oh, no, I was somewhere I shouldn't have been. Very well, brother. I accept my punishment. I don't need anything. I still need to look through your pocket. Sure. You have a weapon. I do. You failed to complete... Oh, no, he kicks, kicks me out? Wait a minute! Yes, wait a minute. This monastery is a nest of rats. I tell you. Also, I, I got the... Praise be... I got an autosave after... I'm reloading. So I did... I have been up there already. And I... I think... Are you coming? He got stuck. Either way, it's fine. We have the thing. We don't need to talk to him. Uh, we just need to avoid... Servus. The wrath of people. Uh, I can also stash my things. Hello. I could stash my things. Why not? Sure. Do I have anything that's stolen? Yeah, right there. That's much better. Nobody's gonna check in there. And then I can come back if I ever need to kill someone. Also, I'm pretty sure I don't need the dagger for anything. It's not like, it's not like I, it's not like I was right in saying ah, oh, it's just it's a thing. But yeah, well, whatever. So in here we're probably gonna get some punishment because of how obsessed with not being where they where we should have been. The money is going down. Progress. It's good. Also, when we started here, we had um, a jail sentence in here, but now we don't anymore, and I like it. I like not having a jail sentence. That's that's a favorite activity of mine. Also, we could we could simply stick around over here and be like, mm, yeah, I'm, pr I'm 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 praying from over here today. Uh, who was it? But I'm not gonna do that. It's not one of these guys. It'd be interesting. Uh. Oh, that's Antonius. No, no, it's Gregor. Is it Gregor? Lucas. Hey, dude. This is not a good time. For I am so sorry. Oh, look at all of them. They're coming. I have the key. I could open it. Just like that. <laughs> That's good to know. And I'm pretty sure it's not stolen or anything. Even though it should be. It's probably a quest item. I got two keys for the forbidden books. Yeah, everything is good. 
everything is fine. So you're just sticking around over here, isn't it? That's the part of the, that's the quest. Go to church. Yes. Ooh, also, there is paintings. Look at the paintings. This guy is just shouting things. Hey, you're doing that wrong, dude. That's why he's a saint. He's, he's always right. And that dude is like, oh, no, not this one again. And this guy is learning because he's telling him, you need to shove the thing. I don't know what he's doing. He's building things, I'm pretty sure. And then over here we have uh, the devil. Interesting, those legs. It's an interesting depiction. I do know that the um, goat legs were uh, not, you know, that common early on. They are a little bit more common later on, uh, after the fourteenth, the fifteenth century. Uh, and over here we have the exhumation of someone. Maybe. What could he be? This is Saint Wenceslas, right? It's the story of the, the saint here, Saint Benedict, maybe. Uh, probably not Wenceslas. Was this a different one? Um, oh, so he stole the co the coffin, and he just okay. Now I'm gonna be buried, and he is buried. Look at him going all smug and stuff. Still alive because he has the aura. It's very important. It's I'm kidding, of course. That's the aura is still is is there even if you're dead, in uh, Catholic uh, iconography. Oh, I was pressing W. Deer hunting spot. No, I don't want that. Quest giver. Beehive. And we still need to figure out... Oh, we could read the... the. Oh, no. That pauses the game. We could read the um, jotted notes, because this is important. So it says, Descend from the gate of faith between the shadow of the cathedral and the wooden stockade. Which is this. It's this gate. The descend bit is just uh, to throw it away, because that, that text is written in a way that's like, to pretend it's saint and godly and all that, but it really is just a secret stash. Probably more pages of the art of love, I, if I had to guess. Oh, is he gonna, is he gonna pray? Or say the, ma say the mass? I th does it, is it saying the mass? Hello. Are you gonna arrest me? Oh, no. I definitely... Oh, we were all waiting. And now we're saying the creed, I believe. That's where, that's credo. It starts with that. Which is a very important... I don't know actually what the, the um, official creed is, or when it started. But I think it's a pretty old stuff as well. Because I remember seeing it as well in... Um, uh, Expeditions Viking, which you should definitely play. It's an amazing game. And it's turn-based, so it's even more amazing than being amazing. Uh, but they were already all about the creed, and oh, it's the creed and all that's important. It's like the m basic foundation of the church, which uh, you'd expect to be, mind you. We've been up there. That's the... right behind that, that's the um, sleeping quarters. Anyway, we're here. Uh... What? Attorney? Shut up. I'm, I am I have other business to attend to. I can't enroll. Shut up. Nobody's gonna see me. At least, I hope not. Like, this is the perfect opportunity to not be seen. I definitely wasn't seen. Oh, it. I think it pauses. So, Saint Adalbert. I read this one. So, drop. On Simony. <laughs> Off goes the book, did you notice? Uh, and, uh. Book of Prayers. Hmm. Very saintly. Who's this guy? Okay. Um, oh, let, we'll need to look at the time. Everyday labors. So this is going to be until 6 p.m. And then we have the supper. Which is always very good. So this should be enough. Hopefully. Although the change, the sudden change of soundtrack kind of 
puts me on edge. Oh, they're off. Oh, no. Wait for me. Don't eat everything. Eat. I know. I know. Are you guys going to admoest me? Is that the correct word? I don't even know if that's the correct word. Oh, there you go. Hello, everyone. The boss has arrived. Now, where do I sit? No, actually, I should talk to um, some of these people. To Jodok. To uh, Antonius. But uh, we're going to need to do that next episode because we're out of time for the day. So for right now, I'm Critical RPG, and this has been Kingdom Come Deliverance. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video if you want to see the next episode come out sooner rather than later. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.